Okay, so this is my first video for YouTube. Um, I just did a flight video of this, the new Blade MSRX, and as I was reviewing it, I realized the beginning of the video was pretty boring because it was just the camera pointed at my kitchen. Um, and then I transitioned into flying it. So I figure I'll just redo the beginning of the video. So if I repeat anything here that I do when you see me fly the helicopter, that's the reason why. Anyways, this is the MSRX. I picked this up in a local hobby shop in Pennsylvania. Um, I'm intermediate pilot, I would say. Um, I am trying to transition from fixed pitch to collective pitch, so I don't know if that still puts me a beginner or novice or whatever you want to call it. Um, but the guy at the local hobby shop told me if I can master this little heli, then I can probably be fine with collective pitch. Um, I've heard differing opinions about that. I don't know if that's true or not, but I thought, what the heck, I'll give it a shot, and it's a neat little helicopter. So as you can see, it's got no fly bar, um, hence the X in the name, as opposed to just MSR, which had a fly bar. Um, and so I flew it outside uh, before our winter weather came in and actually um, got it to do uh, fast forward flight, no problem figure eights um, which I hadn't been able to do with my uh, 120 that I have um, so I was pretty excited about that um, it's kinda squirrely not very easy to control um, you gotta definitely pay attention to it as opposed to like the uh, MSR which I didn't fly but I have heard that you could pretty much take your hands off the control and fly it no issue so um, it comes with the uh, Blade MLP 4DSM controller, which isn't great. It, it serves a purpose, but I really need to upgrade to a digital controller. So I'm gonna looking at the uh, DX6i, and then it comes with this is the obviously this is the uh, ready to fly version. The bind and fly, from what I understand, just comes with the heli. It doesn't come with the battery. Doesn't come with the controller. Doesn't come with the charger. And the interesting thing about this that I've come to find out is I don't know if you can see but this is a 25C battery. Uh, it's not very, it's kind of blurry. Uh, as opposed to the 12 you might get with other helis, which I believe came with the MSR. So um, you can't really, you'll get about 30 seconds of flight time out of a smaller battery. Um, so you have to buy a couple of these. Unfortunately, right now, everybody sold out of them. So who knows about that? So I will transition over to the flight video. And you'll see how it flies. Uh, thanks for watching. And for any of you that are interested in purchasing this heli, um, you'll see a lot of reviews where it's kind of squirrely. People th say it's kind of squirrely, and it is kind of squirrely. Um, I'm going to put it somewhere so you guys can see it. Um, it took me. Almost immediately I got into a hover. I kind of wrecked it once because it came off and went to the rag, which helicopters will do. Um, but let's see, let's give it a shot. So there it is. And it's not, I never flew the MSR, but from what I've seen and what I've been told, it is super stable. And you can hover it for like, without any, Control input this one, you can definitely not do that. You have to be on top of this thing. Even I got it trimmed out pretty good, but it is still a handful to fly. Once you get it stable, it'll stay stable, but then it'll start to pull the bowl or it'll drift forward or drift to the rear. I've messed with this, um, uh, the adjustments on it trim adjustments on it and it's still kind of wonky. Um, I do need to get a computerized controller. I'm looking at getting the DX6i. Uh, um, that's going to be next month when the wife says I'm clear to do that. Um, but many times this works and I'm having fun and I'm learning a lot. So, Alright, so there's a quick little flight of the new Wade Heli. Which takes a lot of concentration to fly, and I'm going to land it now before I crash it, and we'll call that take one. Oh. 
So, let me see if I can zoom in on that for you. Yeah, it's kind of grainy on this camera. But that's it. And I hope you liked the video. If you're an intermediate pilot or a beginner pilot with a lot of experience on coaxials and fixed pitch, small fixed pitch helicopters, I would definitely recommend the Blade MSRX. Um, it does take quite a bit to, to fly, um, but once you get a hang of it, um, it's, it's pretty fun. Like I said, I got fast forward flight on this for the first time. I was on this helicopter, not so much on the uh, uh, 120SR, um, but this one definitely. So that's it. Thanks.